You know, it's going to be a good one. Um, Coach Flood ultimately makes a lot of decision. And uh, I'm just going to work hard this uh, summer and just say, uh, add on what I did on spring and just try to get better. Hey, now that you can look back at it, were you a little rusty in the spring? I mean, it would be, a, it would be understandable you hadn't played in two years. I just felt like, um, you know, I was just still learning everything. And, um, you know, I guess, I guess you can say that, but I'm not going to take you know, myself for my spring and say it was bad. I learned a lot, and uh, I just got to keep getting better. How was your offseason for you? What you, what you focus on? Uh, focus all on uh, my release and um, a lot on, like, the QB room, just uh, understanding, like, what a quarterback has to understand just on any given play and um, just keep figuring out the offense. Were you here in New Jersey mostly for the offseason, or did you go back home to California? Um, I was here most for offseason, and then uh, this last week I was back in California working out with my quarterback coach. Coach Flood has said he wants to see the quarterback win over the locker room. Have you been working on that? Do you, do you get along better with the guys now that you've been here longer? Um, you know, I feel like it. Um, you know, you really can't work on it. You just, you know, you have friends and uh, you kind of, you know, make more friends when you play, I guess. And, you know, it's kind of, it's how it is. I see it. Working hard, so it's finally football time and we're ready to go. I mean, you ended the spring ahead in the competition according to Kyle. What do you have to do to seal that and win the job? Um, I don't really, I don't really think about it that way. Uh, I think about preparing for you know, camp and the season, and that's what I've been doing throughout the summer. And uh, you know, just working, working hard, uh, developing a really good relationship with uh, the O line, receivers, running backs. You know, essentially the whole team, and um, just trying to be a leader and uh, you know earn respect in the locker room. Uh, you know, as a quarterback, you got to be that guy. So. That's how we try to do. How do you go about doing something like that? Because it seems like a lot of intangible stuff. It's work. It's over time. It doesn't just happen. You can't just do it. It's you know taking me as long as I've been here. So um, ultimately, you know, you gotta you gotta do your job and you gotta perform really well at a high level in order for you know everyone to trust you as well as you know just be a leader on and off the field and just do everything you know the right way like a quarterback's supposed to do. Have you felt that grow over your three years now? Yeah, definitely. I've definitely felt um, you know more confident um, you know, in my relationship with uh, you know the whole team, and then my also my confidence in uh, you know, being a quarterback, being a quarterback.